Hi, hopefuls. You know what? I was taking a picture for Instagram and I said, why not I just make this a video? Um, I know in the past I said I was going to do a tour of my desk, but uh, my desk used to be in the back, y'all. Um, if you saw that video, I'll see if I can find it. And um, I put it in the front over here by the TV. So it was really getting chaotic in here. And this is the front part of my um, craft room. I'll just pan over. So then my TV's right here. Um, here is my rugs for my room, my ceiling fan, um, our blinds over there. So it's a mess um, over here, but I straightened it up. It was worse than that, y'all. So I just could not plan. I could not um, really function. And every week or every day, I'm trying to critique my office, my, my desk area and you know for it to function the way i want it to function or to look so i do did realize that um these cubes were somewhere else in the room their recollections at michael's they're really expensive now but anyway i think i'm gonna pull that stuff out but i don't have time right now and use some of the drawers for office supplies i don't know but our Sometimes if I don't have a place for it, I like for it to sit out instead of tucking it in a space that it doesn't belong. I don't know. I'm like that all over the house. Like I'd rather for it to be organized in the cabinet than throw it in the cabinet and it sit and I'd rather for it to sit out. Well, I don't rather for it to sit out. I want to organize before I put it up, but sometimes you need to just throw it in the cabinet so you don't see it, y'all, out of sight, out of mind, so it won't... um bother you i guess so anyway i'm just gonna do like a little quick tour of my office space it's not perfect i just was like oh i'm just gonna show um since i was gonna do an instagram picture i was like you know what how about i share um my little office space over here so in the back part is really chaotic and i can't show that part because it's something that i'm working on that will come down the pipe later <laughs> And, um, yeah, and it's also a mess. I had to get everything streamlined. So, over here, I have, um, I have not been using them like I thought. Um, my gold mine and cocoa calendars, um, I just rearranged them. I used January, February, and March, and April was like all cross here. And I moved them last night, um, over here. So, I wanted to kind of plan out things, but I'm kind of, I know my personality. I don't like to be stuck in a box. So I think that's just my creative spirit. So um, I like to have structure. I like to have a plan. But if I don't want to do this this day, I'll pick something else unless it has to be done. So this board was in the hallway and it was not being used. And I wanted to clean, uh, simplify the hallway because since I have all my couponing stuff in there. And I think I'm going to put this board up here because I really don't have any room above my uh, above my desk. And I'm short, so I won't be able to reach it anyway to change it out. So over here are my planning stuff that I use all the time. I didn't plan on doing this video, y'all. So I didn't double check to see what the floor looks like. I did vacuum a little bit. So I have like some craft paper, lots of stickers, um, lots of sticker books. I've really been going ham on the planner supplies and I'm going to scale back because you can't use but so much at a time and I still have stuff from like when I first started planning and I'm going to just start slapping down stickers <laughs> slapping down stickers um I need to give my mom some and just yeah I have been starting to slap down stickers but I'm gonna do it even more so so I have my goals journal by Go Mine and Coco. I make sure um I think I purchased this twice. And usually by March I kind of stop. But I am going to keep going with my goals. So I have sticker books by um Live Love Posh. I love her books. I haven't used any yet. Um lots of sticker albums. Most of the sticker shops I've been ordering from are of course Gold Mine and Coco. Um the Live Love Posh, Fabulously Plans all the time. I order from her, her $1 Wednesdays. And then she has like a code, Fab Friends 10. And so you get that off too. But I had to talk myself out of, which I have about everything. <laughs> it's the three things I taught myself out of not getting her anniversary 
uh, not anniversary, what was it? Ultimate planner sale this weekend. Forgive my nails, y'all. Um, let's see, Anika, she's a new shop to me. I think she may have been around two years, I think. I'm not sure, but this is her shop. Anika Creative Closet. She has some sticker books, so I ordered from her twice. And I'm trying to think who else I've been ordering from. Um, Ella Isis Jewels. Um, here is one of her. I have to make sure I'm not showing nothing. Here's one of her notepads. And who else I've been ordering from, if you guys want to know? Um, let's see. Oh, so paper. So those are the main people I've been ordering from um, recently. So here on my desk, it actually was a black desk. So that's why you see where it is like worn here. So if you watched my video when I was talking about chalk paint, I redid a lot of the furniture in my craft room with chalk paint. So I need to, um, one day when I'm not busy, take everything off and repaint this or just paint the parts that look bad. So that's why I like chalk paint. Um, yeah, it wears down, but you can go over it with some a fresh coat of paint and it will last you for a while. I don't think I use the glaze. I may have, yeah, I have. I can tell I have. So guys, um, really, I just have some notepads. I was just trying to clean it and simplify it um, this last night. And then my main computer is a refurbished computer from Walmart and it comes in different pieces and stuff. So what I did, I try to critique, critique this space more and more like, am I using this? Is this in the way? Um, what do I want something a little bit better? What would I like a little bit better? So I wanted a larger monitor. Uh, I got the Samsung monitor from Walmart. I think it was like 159. I can't remember y'all. I still like the keyboard. It came with this, like a Dell keyboard. Um, the refurbished computer was like two something. I had it for about almost two years now or a year, almost a year, I believe y'all. So um, it's an H, no, it's an HP. And I just like that it clacks. So um, that's why I haven't gotten a new one. Um, it is wired. Uh, my mouse is wireless. So I like a wireless mouse. It's just easier. Uh, let's see, from Amazon, I did get a webcam because it took a while because um, I was having, before I got my MacBook, which I have a haul on it, I'm gonna share with you guys. Before that, I was struggling with the cameras on my connecting. I just had issues because my HP wasn't working well anymore. Um, Jason's laptop would be slow sometimes. My iPad would sometimes connect to things and sometimes it wouldn't. So anyway, I have different Zoom meetings and stuff to attend and I got a webcam. So that's a pretty good one and I got it off of Amazon. I'll try to link stuff below. I have a habit of not doing that. So I just got a flower arrangement. I had this for a while. I think I got it from Marshalls. And my pens, I love using these pens. And I just love to have my lotion and lip balm. I have my glasses over here. I just put my paper clips. I love to have them within reach. Um, there's some sticky notes. So they were down here in this area, but I put it up there to kind of out of sight. My speakers... They were actually for the boys from Five Below. It's part of a gaming. I can't think of the name of the gamer, but they don't have that many at Five Below. So I bought the boys like uh, or JJ. I was gonna get him a gaming computer, but he ended. I ended up finding um, a friend. She was selling her X, the new Xboxes. So that's what he ended up getting for Christmas. So. Um, you can take stuff back to five below, but I didn't bother. I just said I use it as far as my speakers. They're not that pretty, but they are okay quality. Um, I have my camera there. Sometimes I leave my camera downstairs on the top top row of the uh, counter so that I can have it when I do a haul right away or um, if I'm cooking. But lately it's been up here. Um, my mat <laughs> is starting to look a little grungy. It is from Gold Mine and Coco. So let me lift this up. I did scotch guard it, so I probably don't see if I can wipe some of it off. But, um, 
super cute all the patents you know starting to look a little grungy right here and i'm gonna see if i can wipe it off today yeah because i don't like that but anyway um that was a la carte she had it was part of um i want to say the advent calendar they had for christmas and i was able to grab one so this is my new macbook and i keep talking about it y'all because i am so happy to finally have one but anyway um I kind of go back and forth throughout the day. And next thing I want to see if I can improve on is get a riser for my monitor so I can stick things under it. Because sometimes I need to write and I can put my keyboard under there on my MacBook. I did watch Organized Money and she has like another riser where she um, has our holder where she holds her MacBook. So I might do that. Um, I don't know why y'all have my washi here. I may move it. I have a couple of, um, let's see, I have, I must just slide something over. I have my pen for my iPad. I can't think of the name of it here. And I have some wet erase markers here for my board or for any of my planner boards. I have some washi and some of my SD cards. And then here I have my pens that I use all the time. This is a makeup organizer and my mild liners, which are highlighters. So up here I have, don't worry about anything except pray about everything. I got this from Kirkland's a couple of years ago. So you guys probably seen it before. Um, I may need to get up there and dust those little roses. And then I have some pictures of my kids, my mom and dad right here. My Uncle Kenny, my um, aunt, this is my grandma in the red, y'all, and my Aunt Barbara and Keisha, um, everybody's big, um, Keisha's big now, that's Katrina, y'all, and Jason, and um, me at Go Wild. So I just have some reminders and some prayer um, things up here. I was trying to make a little prayer corner, and I still may. Um, they have lots of YouTube videos on making a prayer closet or a prayer corner or prayer room. Then over here, I don't use this area too much. I dust it off a little bit, but I need to get the step stool and dust off some more. And I look up here and I'm like, oh, you need to use those stamps and stuff like that. I kind of chilled out with the enamel pins because I don't really use them. Um, you can put them on bags and stuff, but I guess too, when I started collecting them, the Corona came out. So, um, I haven't really been anywhere. So these shelves, I think I got, ooh, where did I get these shelves from, y'all? Mm, I don't even remember, y'all. Oh, Home Depot. So I put those in a corner with my little planner books, and then I rearranged some things yesterday. I have this happy uh, camper. I forgot where I said I was gonna put this, but I stuck it here for now. It's from Oso Paper. It was her sub box this month and i love also paper sub monthly sub boxes which i will always keep because it's only 25 dollars, y'all and you get some cute stuff in it so i have some planter rings over there i have more planter rings on the floor when i took some planters apart my old camera i used for five to six five years on youtube um let's see y'all i'm gonna go wild lanyards and the smoky planner girl planner land uh, linear i'm sorry and some more things a little bill um some stamps some punches and this is just like a bunch of um crafting stuff um these are like some of those uh what's those things called i can't think of so i just pull it out some of these um things to make cars the dies the dies and all that which i have not had a chance to use which i want to use but i haven't had a chance to use so then i put some planners here and i have my journal stuff that i want to grab on the regular and then here is um some dolls these are mostly my gold mine and coco dolls so let me show you so you guys were like what is she talking about so if you don't totally get it with the planner thing it's kind of like paper dolls so if you guys are my age or even older, you know what paper dolls are. So I wish that was around when I was little. 
then I have a self-care journal. This one, I haven't started yet, but I'm about to um, with Oso Paper because I'm doing a journaling. I'm doing a self-care boot camp through Journal Jot and Jive this week. So I'm going to have to really um, hone in on some things. Let's see, I have to move this. Okay, then over here, y'all, is just scrapbook papers. I cleared this one out for like some papers or stuff that I'm working on right now. Um, this drawer over here broke and my old HP is over here. And then I need to organize my cores. I was trying not to show you guys. So every day or every week, I try to think like, how can I improve my space where it works for me? And so last night I was looking for some cords organizers for that um as well all these scrapbook papers are over here and i do plan on using them for something that i'm working on but right now i guess i just leave them there right now because i don't have nowhere else to put them i put my bible stuff up here um my bibles uh, my bible study stuff right where i can read it part of my self-care is to finish the fervent prayer book this week I did have my Bible stuff here. My mama gave me recently. She was about to per, um, throw this away. So in here, I just keep all of my um, kind of like techie stuff. Um, this goes to my MacBook. It's like an adapter. It's the type of MacBook that I have. I can't even think of the name of it, but it's a new one. I'll see if I can find it and put it across. This is an adapter that I have to use to get the information from my um, SD card or my, it's confusing y'all because I have a refurbished computer and it's an older, um, deal if you see right here. So it doesn't have like an attachment to put, or it doesn't have a compartment to put a USB, a SD card in, I'm sorry, a SD card. So I needed that attachment from Amazon. Amazon got everything y'all. So anyway, it just has all my different things in it. I'm trying to make this video short. There's my cover for my MacBook, my stylus um, sets. I was watching Meech and Monica, and Monica got these. And these are great to edit on your phone. Um, my lotions and my daily bread. Some, I just put more stuff in there last night. Some staples. I don't think nothing's in the bottom. Then I put these, this collection of sticker books here just so my Bibles wouldn't fall. And I can reach some. These are some stickers I need to put away in the albums. So I um, stuck them here that I recently got in the mail. Um, this was down on the floor. And I said, well, let me put this here. Then maybe I won't be prone to put, th put things in this space. So this was really cluttered and so forth. I just put some of my planner bags, organizers. I recently got this one. And... This one here is supposed to be my spiritual faith organizer tote. So I can just take it here and there. But I haven't been using it. This book is like any courses or anything that I purchase. I have so many like different PDFs and stuff. I need to print them out, punch holes in them, and put them in a large binder. So that's what I've been doing recently. Over here is just like some lamination papers. Okay, y'all, so I had to stop for a minute. So I think I left off. Uh, let's see, over here I have lots of pens. Some of these, I think I have went through them recently of what I use and what I don't use. Um, these back here, I just recently got. These are some, I got these for planning, but also for journaling. Um, the Tombow, so I got those from Michaels and I got these Sharpies, if you saw that haul at the end. The pastel colors from Walmart. And these are just the, um, I guess they're flower arrangements, containers. But if you shop at the dollar spot, they have like little things like this all the time. Bullseye Playground at Target. And you can just use it to hold your hold your pens and stuff. So, um, also this is like a little washi card book. My Alexa, I absolutely love. A lot of times I use it for like to set a timer because I'm trying to time block. I'm trying to get better, um, efficient with that. Time block my time. So I will set a timer for an hour or 30 minutes. And I usually get more done in that time period and don't have no distractions than 
not setting the timer. I use it, of course, for the weather every single day, multiple times a day, sometimes for a lot of times for music. So those are the main things because um, usually she don't answer the questions right. It's just best to ask Google. Then I have one of these little, I don't know what they're called, but you put like little sayings in them and I probably need to put something in there. I haven't done that in a while, so I need to figure out where did I put all oh, there in there. Then, um, here are some Crayola marker kind of like things. Let me just show you. They're kind of like the Tombow markers, but they, the tip is a little different and they're darker. But anyway, I thought I took them out, but they're still in there. So I thought I put my little riser for my iPad. I was using this just like a computer one time. It works, but you don't. You know, everything's not efficient on it. Um, I don't use my iPad a whole, whole lot, but I just set it there in case I need it for something. I do have a mouse that goes with the iPad and a keyboard, which is downstairs, which I need to bring up here so nobody won't mess it up. This goes to my MacBook. So I needed a certain mouse for that. I think that's it, y'all. Let's see. Did I get down here? I have some devotional books. I have my Erin On Demand top three daily priorities. Let's see. Journaling card. Um, my Gold Mine and Coco quilted fitness planner. So this is what's not. I wanted it, <laughs> but I'm not using it like I should on my wellness journey so i have like certain inserts i got her dashboards so this was only for fitness and wellness um her inserts and so forth but i don't remember to go in here if i was talking about it in a video and use it throughout the day so that's why i got those happy planner fitness sheets to put inside of my Franken plan happy planner. Franken plan is just taking a bunch of inserts and create putting it all in one planner so that it can work best for you. I think I said it right. Then I'm doing real appeal, which I have missed two appointments. We have virtual appointments. Real appeal is just a program, weight loss program that's through well, it's through our insurance company. So I talked about that too. And my books were like tucked in something else. And I was like, oh, there's my fitness books. So they have like different guides. Well, you guys don't care. Like recipes and stuff in here. And then this one has, they gave us DVDs. So it has like a workout program on what to do on which days. And then this is what I got from Oso Paper recently. Um, this is a cute bag, y'all. And I think I have more pens in here, some more new pens, some Sharpie, different color pens. But um, I like the little pockets. And this was part of that subscription box for $25, y'all. This bag, um, this book of stickers, her monthly sticker, this little journaling book, and probably something else. But that's just what I have right here. Then also to make my space more efficient or to work for me, um... I probably have a lot of stuff over here that I don't really need at hand. But I had, to, my chair looks comfortable. I remember you guys talking about uh, when I posted it probably a couple years ago on Instagram and Facebook. But it's not. <laughs> it's not that comfortable. So I had to get, first I got the back cushion from Amazon. And then I got the bottom um, cushion next. I have I have been thinking about getting the little foot rest thing at the bottom which I may get next um, to improve my space. But I don't know if I need it because my feet does touch the floor. A lot of times my feet don't touch the floor when I sit back in a chair. And I'm trying to think if that's everything, y'all, that's over here in my little space to share with you all. But I thought that I'm like, hey, I'm taking a picture. I do want to get a larger trash can. That one's kind of too small. For here, I've been looking at just when I walk by in Walmart and stuff. But, yes, I hope you enjoyed this video. I was trying to make it short, but looking at the time, it's going to be longer than I want it to be. So, guys.
Thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.